How are you? All right, Craig Smith swears by these, right? Yes, he Tell uses us them why. for his golden doodle. Yeah, Tell because us why you do design this. This, by the way, if you have it, give us a call. It's the harness lead. It has a future price of $24.96, but why did you decide to, I was to design a, this? I was a volunteer in an animal shelter, Jane, and mm -hmm. I just walked so many dogs, and there was just a couple of different issues that, that needed correction. The pulling was one, mm -hmm. and then dogs getting loose, dogs that knew how to actually back out of their harness or their collar. So harness lead um, is really an invaluable tool for that because they're unable <laughs> to back out. They're unable to wriggle out of it. So right. it gives you a real sense of security. And it helps with the pulling too. Like just the other day I had a QVC customer call me mm -hmm. and say that she has a female pit bull. Right. And it was just pulling so, so bad. And uh, this just tried you know, it totally changed everything for them. So we have the red purple that you've seen tonight. We also have this in black. And then there's two sizes, by the way. The red purple is by far the most limited. So what, how do we figure out our size? Yeah, so there's two sizes. The small medium is 14 pounds up to 40 pounds. So it's really not for a tiny dog. Mm -hmm. So it's 14 to 40. And then the medium large is 40 and up. Right. So show us what's different compared to another lead. Because you said well, I'll show they you don't how. pull and they're not going to get out of this. Yeah. Which is like every, you know, dog lovers and dog Absolutely. owners Absolutely. So I'll show you how it goes on the dog. It's very, very simple, which is another great uh, aspect of it is that is simplicity. why some large cat users use this too. <laughs> yes, this is true, and pigs and mm -hmm. goats. This is true. So to size it for your dog, you can just either make it for small, or you can just size it the collar for big. So for Raven here, it's about this size. Mm -hmm. And the way you size it for your particular dog is you just take your stops and you move them in line with the back of the front leg. So if you do that, it's going to fit any dog's body perfectly. And then you just take the leash and you just go underneath the body and you bring the handle up through the opening, the stop up through, and then you just lower it down. Right. And the way it reduces pulling, Jane, mm -hmm. is when the dog pulls, it's going to tighten around the barrel only. Okay. So there's no tightening around, around the, the neck, neck area. which always so worries dog, me. Yeah. And the dog won't be choking and gagging on the walk. Um, here, here we you have see, some video. Yes. And here you see uh, Brody, who was a very bad puller. Now, this is Charlie pulling on a regular collar. And then we just put harness lead on Charlie, and she is walking right by my side. That is just one shot right after the other. Wow. What we did was change the leash. And there are my four dogs. Oh and I'm my walking gosh. four big dogs with one hand with Who harness lead. Who is that lead. large one? That's Lucy, Gracie, uh. Baggins, and Rinky. Uh. Yes, they're so sweet. Oh but I can gosh. control them all with the harness lead. And, and so cool. I have a sense of security. I know because Rinky, oh my, um, my one dog, is an escape artist. He knows how to back out of a collar or a harness. And he's unable to do that with harness leads. So I, I'm more relaxed on the walk. I'm right. more confident because I know that my dogs are not going to get loose from me. You guys are the best. You're so good. Yes, they yeah, are. You very, are. very good. If my cat was here, she would not be this good. I'm telling you, no. Um, in the red purple that you designed, yes. the large extra large has just sold out. So we only are left in the black. And I think this is such a great gift. Um, Maybe you're a little worried about mom and dad with their dog, yeah. taking the dog out for a walk, right? right? Maybe you're a little bit concerned about a new dog walker that's coming over, or maybe, you know, this is your child's chore, but you want to make sure um, that, that the dog's not getting away, that as a handler, you're not falling. Yes. I mean, this is just all about safety and it's mm -hmm. all about love. And that's what pets are. They give us so much love. Mm -hmm. I'm so happy that you designed something that's so much better for the dogs. Like. It, I, I was watching you put it on, and I think we have a minute left. Can we show oh, that yeah, again? Oh, yeah, definitely. I'm just fascinated with how you figured it out. <laughs> because it's, like, so different than the way you usually see just a collar and a lead. And, Jane, you know what? Sometimes people look at it and they say, I don't understand how this could possibly right. make a harness. Right, right, But it's really so simple that you just can't overthink it. Mm -hmm. So all you're doing is literally just putting it over the head, and then you're just taking the leash and wrapping it underneath the body and bringing everything up through the opening. So it's really that simple. Right.
Right. And then it creates actually the perfect harness where it's not tightening around the neck mm -hmm. and it's only tightening around the barrel. Right. And much of the time, this, this acts as a floater. So when, so much of the time it may be up in the air. So mm -hmm. you just let it rise and fall as, as it does. And it's nice and soft too. I don't know if you well, felt it. Oh my it, gosh, absolutely. And Craig yeah. Smith swears by it, you know, and he's already shown the very dapper photos of his dog earlier tonight. And that's cool with Jane. <laughs> this is the red purple combination. This is only left in the smaller of the okay. two sizes. If you want the larger lead, we still have it available, but we also have it in the black. Earlier tonight, it was so cute. We all came into the operations desk and we thought this was a real dog. <laughs> we were absolutely in love with him, but no, he's just here for demonstration purposes. John Holt, come on out here. John is our next guest. Oh, the buddy's nice. Right. Hi, John. Now, John, how many dogs do you have? I've got two dogs and a cat, and that is my dog. Right